In today's video, we're opening up Wizard of the Coast's latest set, Murder at Karlov's Manor. It's all about the scene of the crime, and this set has a ton of great new cards, including surveil lands that are fetchable. And I'm hoping to pull a bunch today. Let's find out how many we can get in this collector booster box. Okay, here we go guys, Murder at Karlov Manor. I'm actually really excited about this. It's actually not my box. This is actually Phoenix Comics' box. Uh, they're a game store in Calgary, Northwest. I'll give the link in the description to find them in Calgary. I don't think they have an online store yet, but they are working on that. So when they do have that, I will update that in the description. But for now, let's crack open this collector booster box. Really asking the question, how many surveil lands can we get? It looked like we got about 8 to 10 shock lands from the Ravnica Remastered set. I don't know if we're going to be that lucky with lands for this set, but let's find out today. Okay, first collector booster pack. Let's see how difficult these packs are to open. Ooh, I like that. A lot easier to open now. Some of them were really difficult uh, from previous sets, but let's see what we have here. So we have a clue token. <laughs> there we go. Right away we got a surveil land. Commercial district. Very, very cool. And they get Cranko, Baron of Tin Streets. Final word phantom, then we get doppelgang as well with an outrageous robbery. Holy crap. Speaking of outrageous, the amount of rares in that set was pretty, pretty outrageous. Let's go with the next pack here. So, so far we have one of the lands. Let's see if we can get at least six, that'd be nice. Okay, let's see here. We have another mythic here. We have a mythic here, Delny Streetwise Lookout. Very, very cool. And then we have World Souls Rage, a nice borderless card. Serene Sleuth, and then we have Hide in Plain Sight with a Cryptex as well. And then on the job, back to back on the job as well. Thinking Cap, very, very cool. Next up, so far still only one, but let me know if you guys are excited about this set. Pre-release is Friday, so um, let me know if you're actually planning on grabbing some product. We have Ill-Timed Explosion, and we get another one here, Elegant Parlor. Very, very cool. So we have another Surveil Land. Then we get Trouble in Pairs, Barbed Servitor with a Urgent Necropsy, and this is another Mythic. So two Mythics so far, and I love the murder. Oh my god, look at that. That is incredible. One of the most iconic cards to me because when I first started learning how to play Magic Gathering, uh, that was the first removal spell that I came accustomed to and I hated playing against it. I just hated it. It's just, even the name was so snarky, Murder. It's like, yeah, you killed my creature, congrats. Here we go, Fugitive Codebreaker, Audience with Trostani, and then we have Innocuous Researcher with Blood Spatter Analysis and Lazov, Wearer of Faces as well. Very, very cool. So we're still on to that's pretty good. That's pretty on pace. Okay. So let me know what you guys think about the prices. Do you think they're going to tank on these surveil lands or do you think they're actually going to go up? Ooh, look at that. Foil Tragic Slip. And this is in the special guest slot. That is incredible. I pulled a, a few special guest cards before, but never one in foil. So first time for me, that is really cool. Then we get the Anzrag, the Quake Mole. So this card has been responsible for quite a few cards going up on the Market Mover videos. People are really excited to build a commander deck around this card. Absolutely stunning. I love that we got that in this booster box. Tangled Trove Kelp, and then we have Arc Druids Charm with a Case of the Uneaten Feast. Okay, really awesome. Next up, last pack in the first row. And we're moving on to the second row after this. Still on, uh, what is it, two so far, I think? Lost in the Maze. Then we get Lazov, Wear of Faces with Mirko, Obsessive Theorist with a Deadly Cover-Up. And then we get, there we go, I think this is the third one, Lush Portico. Not too bad at all. So we got three so far, and uh, that looks like it's it. So I said about six. We're pretty much on point right now. Three from the first row. If we get three from this row, then we're pretty much even. So it's like every other pack. We have Urgent Necropsy again, and then we get Vanifar Evolved Enigma, and then a Ransom Note and a Coveted Falcon with a Krenko's Buzz Crusher. What a buzzkill. We did not get another one of the Surveil Lands. Let's find out if we get one in this pack, though. Hit that like button if you are finding this channel out there. Really would appreciate the support. It does help the channel out. We have, ooh, and this is a very, very cool frame here. Try to Deadly Fugitive. Look at that. Yeah, I think this is a special frame right here, guys. That is incredible. It is the Vampire Assassin. Unbelievable. I'm definitely going to have to sleep this at the end of the video. I was not expecting to get one of these today. Holy cow. Then we get Sharp Eyed Rookie with a On the Trail. And then we have Ill Timed Explosion with an Officious Interrogation. And the chase is on for the next Surveil Land. Is it going to be in this pack? Let's find out. I think we're still on three, right? Hmm. 
A little lower than a Ravnica Remastered uh, odds here. Sharp-Eyed Rookie, and then we get, there we go, the fourth one, Underground Mortuary. Not too bad, Swamp Force. Unshakable Tail, Krenko's Buzz Crusher again, Assemble the Prayers, and then we have Fey Flight. Okay, so four here. We have three packs to go. Not bad. I think we could probably get at least two more. Let's see if that's going to be the case, though. We have a clue token there. Then we get Judith. Carnage Connoisseur, Anzrag's Rampage with a Veiled Ascension, and a Steam Core Scholar with an Ill-Timed Explosion. Okay, moving on to the next pack. Two packs to go. We, if we're going to hit that average that I was suspecting we might hit, that means we're going to have to get one Surveil Land in each one of these packs. Is that even possible? Let's find out. We have Cryptex there with a Doorkeeper Thrall, Nelly Borka, Impulsive Accuser, Illicit, Masquerade, and then we have Lost in the Maze. Oh no, no, I don't know. I don't know, we haven't seen a, a pack with like two and one, so I don't know if this is gonna happen, unfortunately, guys. I just don't know if it's gonna happen, but we'll see if we have any last pack magic here. So we have Lazov, Wearer of Faces, and then we have Kellen, Inquisitive Prodigy with a show-stopping surprise and a Cryptex as well with a unyielding gatekeeper and that means we didn't get it so unfortunately not quite the amount that i was hoping for with this pack and box i should say so let's see quickly how many of them we got i think it was four just want to make sure i got that count right holy cow yeah so we had the one there and i think we had one that's the second third and four wow yeah actually i think this is Pretty low odds, only to get four in one box. That's not really good, but let me know if you enjoyed this box opening down below in the comment section. And also check out Phoenix Comics if you are in Calgary. I will see you guys in the next video.